Hi, I'm Lana Paul, a life coach and certified grief recovery specialist with the Grief Recovery Institute. Have you ever seen an incident where it was so horrific that you couldn't get it out of your mind and the, the visual and the thoughts about it are just always there. You can't seem to get away from them. Today I want to talk about what happens when we don't have the tools to recover from such losses. Imagine a steam kettle on the stove and there's a hot fire burning underneath it. And what normally happens is the steam escapes through the, the spout and we hear a whistle when the water is boiling. But what happens if a cork gets jammed down into the spout? As pressure builds up, there is no way for the steam to escape the spout because that cork is, has it trapped. The cork represents a lifetime of misinformation that has taught us not to talk about our sad, painful, or negative emotions. As pressure builds up in our personal steam kettle, we will often seek behaviors that allow us to numb ourselves from that feeling. You may be choosing food for this. You may reach for alcohol or drugs. Maybe it is anger that you use to deflect that you're really hurting underneath. These behaviors make you feel different, but not better. They simply serve as a distraction. And underneath it all, underneath the cookie or the food or the alcohol or the drugs, you still have all of those painful emotions. There are three problems with engaging in these behaviors. One is that they create an illusion of being better. Two, they don't last. And third, there is no way to remove the cork out of that spout so that the steam can release. Eventually our steam kettle is overloaded and those behaviors just aren't working for us. Imagine what it would be like if we have all of that unfinished business and all of that pain, all of those painful emotions still underneath the surface and a major event happens, we might just explode. And I know that's happened with me in the past and I wonder if that's happened with you as well. Actions of grief recovery will help you remove that cork and help you to process the emotions that you've been carrying in your life. If you feel like you have exploded or that you are close to exploding, I would love to be able to have a con conversation with you and see if I can't help you remove that cork from your spout. Please give me a call and we can schedule a 30 minute conversation and see if we're both a fit.